Hello friends. Today, I'm gonna take this guy on an adventure. Well, an adventure for him and kind of just maybe a walk for me, but definitely adventure for him. So come along. First we have to put his harness on. That's for safety. Or just so he doesn't run away. This way, buddy. Tater, come here. Stay. Come on. Almost ran it, got away from me. A lot of dogs around here. Come on this way, buddy. So first we gotta get him loaded up in the truck. There he goes. You good, buddy? He's good. Oh shit, I it was the tail. No, it wasn't his tail, we're good. All right, we'll see you at the park. So here we are, loaded up. Ready to go. Half the battle is getting him there without him having a mental breakdown. So we have to keep all the windows. We have to keep all the windows up and drive slowly. Ready, bud? You ready to go on an adventure? Your favorite place? Yeah. Okay, we're here at Kenneth Hahn Park. A little hidden gem in the Los Angeles area with what I think is the best views of downtown Los Angeles anywhere. And we're gonna go try to beat the sunset and show you. Just pointing out something completely stupid that I'm doing right now. And that is leaving a bunch of tools in the back of my truck in the middle of Los Angeles. Um, but I have no choice now, so um, here we go. Little spin, the old leash spin, and we're off. Yeah, that's what you do. So, it's not too far of a walk from the parking lot. Oh. Yep, he's doing it. He's doing his deeds. Time out. Fortunately, one of the pitfalls of owning a dog is picking up their poop. I wish they knew how to do that themselves, but they don't. So, here we go. We're off again. He likes to sniff every little tree and shrub that he possibly can, and I don't know what he's looking for, but it must be something incredibly enticing because he can't. Here it goes, look. Another tree, gonna sniff, does a little thing, and then we go again. And that's just his life. So, we do have to cross a very busy in order to get to the park itself but we can handle it we've done it a million times he's doing all right we're gonna be just fine so we just hit the dirt and uh, now it gets a little bit more rural you kind of start to feel like you're somewhere, you know, somewhere besides Los Angeles, but uh, you're not. You're in the middle of the city. We are in 
a little bit of a race with the sun to get to the top so I can show you this. Come on, buddy. Leave it. Leave it. So I can show you this amazing view. Um, so I'm going to kind of have to put the camera down and run for a minute. I'll see you in a minute. All right. So I got us up to the top of the hill. A little out of breath but we made it and now we will continue on our journey to the spot where I think is the best the best view it's pretty nice up here they have all these nice little let me show you all these nice trails and kind of have these little workout areas as you walk around The sun is setting so fast that I'm not sure if we'll make it to the spot I wanted to get to, but I'll give you an idea of the view. It's right behind me over my, uh, I guess it'd be my right shoulder, but I'm gonna switch the camera around here so you guys can see. Well again, I probably made a mistake and I brought a wide angle lens so you can't really see the view that I wanted you to see to begin with, but uh, but it is nice up here. You definitely feel like you're in another world, right Tater? Right buddy? Yeah? So we will continue on our journey and uh, hopefully you guys will come and visit Kenneth Hawn Park sometime. All right, we are back. Um, we'll wrap it up in one minute. All right, we are back from our journey to Kenneth Hawn Park. I learned a few things. I learned to bring the right lens uh, because we got to the top and I had a wide lens. It didn't work. Couldn't see the city very well. Uh, number two, bring enough poop bags because we were short and it got a little bit weird for a minute, uh, but we got past that. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed us and uh, tune in for our next adventure. This is Trevor and Tater signing off.